Yon path leads not to... Care to join me for a glug or free, cuz? Oh! I need a favor, cuz. Feeling generous? I was in your boots once, so I reckon I know your, how you're feeling. There's a few things I'd like to do while I still got the chance. Oh, sure. Thanks, cuz. You want to casually take a jaunt from here? To here? Bro? You want me to escort you around the world? You can go through the cave north of town? What cave? Probably cheaper to use ox carts. Oh, I'm definitely using ox carts. Yeah, dude. Did I run into Keanu when I did my things for Cyberpunk? I didn't. No. I did, the people that I did the recording with though, had worked with Keanu. And they said multiple times how awesome Keanu was during the recording. What was, what was really interesting is that like, um, there were a lot of pretty famous people in Cyberpunk like in in the voice acting field and he's and the guy that i talked to was like yeah you know when the big name voice actors show up they generally have like their manager with them and like an entourage they usually bring like you know anywhere between like two to eight people and you know it's very professional and everyone knows what they do keanu reeves showed up 10 minutes early by himself on a motorcycle and apparently just walked in and was like Hey, what can I do for you guys? You just you just let me know what to do. And he was like apparently super cool about it. He he listened like zero ego or anything. And um anytime they gave him notes, he was just like, "Oh yeah, absolutely." Like apparently he was a freaking legend. And um he was just they they had nothing but amazing things to say about him and working with him. So that was pretty cool. Yeah. You'll have to ask someone If our destination is a distant one, travel by ox cart might be worth considering. Since you're here. Um, oh, what was the what was the other thing they said? That's right. He, when when they were talking about Keanu, this ox cart's bound can't set off. They kind of slid in, and I remember being like, "Man, to slide that in is kind of ridiculous." They kind of slid in that at one point during the recording. Um, Keanu was like, I'm going to go get a drink. And one of the people there, uh, was Make like, oh, no, 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 we'll get it for you. And Keanu out. Reeves was like, oh, no, no, no. Do you guys want anything? And then he like left the recording thing and got the, the staff and people there drinks. And then like came back. <laughs> and he was like, yeah, Keanu just went and got us drinks. It was kind of surreal. <laughs> and I was like, from everything I've heard, that sounds kind of exactly like him. Yeah. So that's kind of fun. Oh wow, we made it. Cool. And our guy's with us. Yep, there he is. Perfect. We can also turn in the Sven quest when we get down there. Wait, there's another? No, it's the same quest. Okay. Poe's gonna lose it when he only gets a bouquet for this. I, I've already realized this is an affinity quest. So I've. So, you seek to enter, but go on through. I've already realized that I most likely will get like absolutely nothing for this quest. Yeah. But we do have another quest that we need to turn in over there. So I figured we can just do that now. It's not a big deal. How is the ox cart not fast travel? Well, I mean, technically it is. Yeah. Oh, Krika 8. Best to you, buddy. All right. I think we will use a fairy stone back. This ox carts will not take you anywhere till I've had my due. Wait. Did I ever get my arch? Nope, not yet. They're still working on it. Nope, no, none of the method 143s are, are out yet. 
They keep me updated though. Ice will be most I get I get your emails from them every every my magic one to three months. You're soaked. Do you try not to catch cold? Most impressive, master. I have some catching up to do. I'll be done. Uh, but we're in the main city. I also need to see if I can get a new thief pond. I want to get a thief pond that has pilfer. Oh, ours does not, unfortunately. You're like to grow overburdened if you keep picking. How much do we have till we level? Wow. Okay, 6,500. So we've got we have every ways to go. Drink you okay. Not too long, but a ways to go. Look at that. I aspire another statue. Oh, I'm sorry. We want plunder, not pilfer. We have pilfer. We want plunder. Thank you. Donka donka. All right, first we'll go and do this guy's quest. Is he coming? Bro? What are you doing? I don't want to like run too far from him or he's just not gonna. Where are you going? Only care I have is how to spend the day. Bro, what are you doing? If I go any further than this, he's just going to disappear and the quest is going to not work. Is he like stuck on the ox cart, people? You know what? No. You don't want to go to your quest? That's fine. That's fine. We're still... Nope. Sorry. We're still going. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come with me. Have you heard tell of an ox cart traveling the road tonight? I've heard Honestly, tell of this ding is not I following every me. Every regulation to the letter and only travel during the day. Why can't others do the same? There's been much talk on the street, oh, but I've heard about? rather. There's a ladder here. Oh. oh, excellent find. That's the Phantom Ox Cart quest. Interesting. It's you. Who there? It's good to see you again. Okay. Man, I hope he gives me some flowers. Thanks, Kaz. Here, Kaz. Just my Thanks, buddy. That was super not worth it. All right, let's go over here. Maybe there's something new here. I'm in no hurry to leave. He's, he's got a red face now, though, so that's good. I don't think one found its way inside the common quarter just the other night. You could say it was an ill to wonder if building a nice. Hmm. All right, let's rest here. Then we're going to go get a new pawn. Then we have this quest to turn in. Great. We'll do that here in a second. Also, probably a good idea, honestly, to just run around the, um, the area a little bit and make sure we haven't missed anything. Not the worst idea. I don't know what these eggs are for. I'm gonna I'm gonna put those eggs away for now. I don't know what those are for. Um, here we go. Okay. We must rest. If you haven't done it yet, there's a quest at your house in this city at night that opens up once you go to Batal. Really? A cedar token. I like it. Not a seeker token. A cedar token. I fought many battles and I trust we've all inspected our equipment. Off we go then. 
Feeling rested, I trust? All right, first to the pond, then to the quest. Then maybe we should check out this phantom ox cart thing. Oh, crossing in shadow crawling? Okay. Interesting. Dang, not a lot of thieves. Female name. Okay. Um. Oh Lord. Plunder. That's what we want, right there. I have a modest talent for spotting materials that can be used to enhance your equipment. Cool. Perfect. Great. Have an apple. Fate willing, the day Are will you fit come to with. travel? Why does Co want a thief pawn? Because I want to see how much he'll steal. I just found out today that if you give if you put a thief pawn with plunder or pilfer, then apparently they will just randomly steal items off enemies. Which is amazing. The Galia sword is brilliant to behold, Master. Um, I expect Sir Roman will be very pleased to see it. I am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your side. You are attentive. In battle, I shall loyal, follow your lead and prioritize. And not plagued. Beautiful. Good checking these I know guys while we're thinking about it. When a curative is needed, Master, you'll never fall you in battle. You are not plagued. Pray, call upon me again another time. You are not plagued. Also, I couldn't tell if that was super sassy or not. That's okay. I like a little bit of sass. Won't someone do aught about this? I cannot afford another night. Our soldiers need better training. Very well. I shall return. Heard that we too, right? shall remain here. <clears throat> Lena is the main pawn of yours? Yes, Lena is my main pawn. You got it. Well met, Sir Arisen. Might I inquire as to what's become of the Regalia Sword? So this is how the sword looked in its glory days of yore. It is splendid to behold. I thought the blade ought to be restored for its history, but seeing it like this, I feel it means something more. Something greater. Pray, give my thanks to the blacksmith who repaired it. Tis fine work she has done. Impeccable, I should say. And you, Sir Arisen, you have my sincerest gratitude. You have breathed life anew into one of our kingdom's most sacred treasures. I can imagine no worthier symbol of a sovereign's majesty. I await the day it shall adorn your noble hip with bated breath. Damn. 35k. Woo! My man. All right. Right. The rumors going around of a phantom Oscar said to appear just after sunset. All right, let's go sleep until night. And then go out and do some deeds. What blacksmith did I use for this, the um, the sword? I used the blacksmith in Batal. And uh, her name is Sarah. And not only did we use her blacksmith, but there was like a, a line of quests that we did to, uh, to make the sword. Like multiple different quests. Follow me then. Unless you doubt my sense of direction. Maybe I do. 
Hey, Speedy, what's up, bud? The Phantom Cart is a hard thing to do, right? Well, let me know if you have any tips. I can't stand this. Greetings. You need only make a worthy offering. I have seen your path. Enter the location of Phantom Oscar sighting. The next milestone on thy path. You've my gratitude. Thank you. That was worth it. It is lovely gold. to see you. Are we to avoid spoilers? Um, we ask that you avoid all story spoilers in the game. Uh, the only time that there may be some spoiling allowed is if I specifically say, um, like, you know, what do we do here? Or what am I doing? Or what happened? You know, that kind of stuff. Yeah. Unequip all your gear, Co-Carnage, before you approach and tell your pawns to stay. What? Shall we get some rest then? That seems terrible. It appears night has fallen while we slept. Shall we check our packs and be off? Shall we get underway? Alex said I was supposed to get a quest here. Oh, just do the quest normally first. Okay, cool. Thank you. Also, give him your bank info. Oh, and social security number? Okay. Okay. Yeah, Krolik, do you have any, uh... Is there aught you require? Do you have any more guidance on where you got this quest, Krolik? You said that, that it was nighttime at our house? As you've gone on, have you started to feel more jaded on the game? Um, I think there's the, the there's the natural feeling of attrition that comes with a game like this. And what I mean by that is, you know, you've seen the same enemy a hundred times, you've got you've killed the same large enemies twenty times. Like that kind of thing is, is of course happening. But I mean I'm what, fifty hours in? And I'm fifty one hours in this game, and it still feels great. I'm still really, really enjoying it. Like, um, it, it's, I have no problems so far. I mean, yeah, absolutely. Some things have happened a bunch and enemy variety could be better and stuff like that. But overall, I'm, I'm having a fantastic time. You might have to do other side quests in Batal first. It has to do with the Empress. Oh, okay. So see, I haven't even met the Empress yet. So that would make sense why I don't have that. Cool. You're the Arisen, I. There's what I'd ask of you. The personage of great esteem is to return from Batal to Vermin. Alec, is this the quest? I speak of Sir Augustine. No. He is a noble and the leading voice of opposition against the Queen Regent. Maybe. Your aid is requested in guarding his ox cart as it travels the high road. As a potential ally to your cause, it would do you no favors if he were to come to harm. Okay. I trust he will cooperate. I'm totally down for this. And bear in mind that this is a matter of the utmost secrecy. Not even the captain of the guard has been informed. Isn't the, is the captain of the guard brand? You have your orders. Read them and follow them to the letter. We must fly to the aid of those in need. Uh, it's not timed. Okay, we'll look at this later. It's not timed, so we're gonna wait on that. Yeah, he was very passionate about it, wasn't he? I agree. <clears throat> what you need of me? Hey, Russell. Russell, bro. Uh, Azareth. Uh, I can cut a piece of wood in half by just looking at it. I know it's hard to believe, but I saw it with my own two eyes. Uh, Jugs and Hugs, about what we were talking about earlier, um, he said, the guy that taught Keanu how to John Wick lives here close to me, and he's told me the very same thing that he's just a regular dude. Oh, cool. Right on, uh, Jugs. Appreciate it. Also love the name. All right, let's go up here. I'm surprised there aren't more spirits and stuff out here since it's nighttime. One day I'll get in that house. One day. Not today. In another world, 
I learned that a forgotten rift stone lies nearby. Hydration is required. Master. Yes. Yes, you should. Was it too late? Shoot. I think it was too late. Darn it. Gotta be quicker. It is all rather sudden, but I suppose we've no reason to refuse. Uh, shall we make for the point of departure? Oh. Very well. I'll guide you there. I brought the number that you requested. I'll take it this will be enough. Aye, nicely done. Get in, you lot. Whoa, wait. What? Here's your payment. Thank you kindly, sir. Ordinarily, coin like this would take me half a year to earn. And I'll thank you to spend it wisely. Don't go drawing undue attention onto yourself, or that'll be the last you get. An ox cart traveling a night is suspicious enough in its own right, if to have known that I'm carrying pawns across the border. Oh, he's a pawn smuggler. I know, and I'll take care of it, I swear it. Contact me again when you've need of more cargo, won't you? Dude. Uh. What is it? I've done not worth following me over. <sighs> Hold, I beg you. I'll tell you what there is to know. I was approached by a Batali merchant I met at the border checkpoint. He offered me a coin in exchange for rounding up pawns. Aye, oh, I know. Here in Vermin, there's nary a deed more abhorrent. But you have to understand, my gambling debts were like to drown me. I needed coin, and I needed it fast. I know not where they've been taken. Pray, believe me. Here, take this. It is a document I got from that merchant. If word of this should reach the palace, I'd no doubt be disciplined. I might even lose my post. I'll give you all the gold I got today. So pray, I beg you, will you let me go? I swear, I'll ne'er do aught like this again. Oh, I suppose it was too much to hope for. Sorry, bud. This is all over for me now. No. Yeah, I'm, I'm a, this, he may have more Many info. Thanks. I don't know. We'll take it from here. Sir. And I don't need his gold. Worry not. He'll receive his due soon enough. Till then, he'll be made comfortable in the dungeons. This guy's voice, though. What Com business have Comfortable you in the dungeon. He will be there if you need him. Mm, yes. Blah, 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 blah. I kind of want him to say that. Blah, 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 blah. What must needs be done? Maybe next time. <clears throat> Dude, all the VA in this game is so good. It's been great. All of the voice acting has been at least passable, if not much better than passable, which is, for a game like this, awesome. Bring the merchant document to some of the connection to the palace. Oh, maybe Brand? Let's, let's go talk to our boy Brand and see if, his, if he has anything to say about this. The entrance to that house is under the bridge. Just run along the riverside. I wasn't oh, thank you. for a moment. Wherever you go, we pawns will always find you, Arisen. Do you take care not to stray so far next time. Yeah. Wait, this is the house to buy, right? So what'll it be? Yeah, okay. Not to twist. Well, you needn't decide. These codes are now here. perma yellow. They're Perhaps growing back yellow. Which I have like a yellow halo. Above. I have a slightly yellow halo. Yes, I do. Still figuring out how I'm going to deal with that. Oh, dude. You have my fullest confidence. About the Phantom Ox card. Yes, Your Majesty. <clears throat> ah, so you've encountered the Phantom Ox card from the rumors. Wow. Okay, so this this must be what they were talking about earlier. Okay, I'm gonna copy that into the chat that will not be named, and we'll we'll see about doing that. To be precise. The letter of the law does not forbid the abduction of pawns. Oh. However, in our sovereign rule kingdom, 
crude treatment of the pawns who so loyally serve our liege is an act decried by all. Okay. If one were to sell them for personal gain, they would doubtless be censured no matter their station. And this letter, by its make and the quality of the parchment, I can only surmise tis of the like used in the palace. See you, Jumpy. We ought to assume a member of the court has a hand in this matter. Thanks, Lucifer. But for what purpose are these pawns being gathered? And where are they being taken? I have a proposal, Your Majesty. Should we ascertain the pawn's destination, perchance we will discover the intent behind this plot. Oh, we're supposed to fake being a pawn? Yet if we question the driver haphazardly, this mission will be over before it begins. I bid Your Majesty follow the ox cart without arousing suspicion, that you might divine where it is headed. Alternatively, mayhap Your Majesty could assume the guise of a pawn and await pickup in a likely location. I leave the choice to your majesty's discretion. Okay. So what we're going to do. You need to wait until the next night to do this step. Just sleep so you have a save you can reload. Okay. So somebody was saying I should probably be Mystic Spearhand for this part of the quest and not, not Mage. Oh, Simata. So pawns are not humans. The way that the way that pawns work is there are these stones that connect to the pawn world and only the arisen can summon pawns through the stones and when the pawns get summoned they have no will of their own the only thing pawns want to do are to serve the arisen that's it so they're kind of like humans that lack a soul that's what pawns are so they're they're not they're human and they look human and they function as human but they they can't die and they don't really have any will outside of just helping the Arisen. Yep. Sounds like slavery. It's not really slavery because the pawns don't want anything. It's not like I've seen. I've seen a lot of con, like a lot of uh, tangents. Like people say, like, "Oh, pawns are this game's version of slavery." Not really. No, because the pawns come here on their own volition. They want to do everything they can to help the Arisen. And then they just leave when they're done. So it's like, they're not, it's not really the same thing. Now, what I will say is that this game is doing some interesting stuff the last game didn't. Because in Dragon's Dogma 1, pawns were basically exactly how I said they were. But in this game, there is a faction that's kidnapping the pawns. And like we saw at the beginning of the game, there's like this weird forcing pawns to do manual labor thing. And it's like this weird situation because the pawns don't care about it. The humans seem to care more about the pawns being used for manual labor than the pawns do. <laughs> so it's not, it's this weird, like, it's not really, TLDR, it's not a commentary on slavery because it's its own thing. And it's a very unique thing that it does. Because the pawn system in this world is not a normal system that you see in games. There's not really a real life tangent that you can connect the pawn system to. So a lot of people are trying to like Welcome. jam real world things into the, the lore of this game. That's not really how it works. So what I'm trying to say is it's a Ponzi scheme. Thank you for that one chat. I appreciate it. Um, yeah, so <clears throat> that's yes. So again, TLDR, well met, sir. the Arisen becomes the Arisen. They I go to Pawn Hub and get their fill. And that's it. That's the game. That's the whole game. That's everything. It's all Do she take wants. care on the road, sir. Mm -hmm. These are dangerous times we okay. live in. You know where to find. So I'm going to go to here. Have you business with the guild, sir? I should be. Okay. Mm -mm. 